before Jesus Christ, how did um, we? How did anyone have their sins forgiven? Hey, Raul, thank you for for that question. Um, and forgiveness, obviously, is is this theme that's not just in the New Testament um, with with Jesus. It's it's something we see all over the Bible um, from the very beginning. You know, you think of the book of Genesis and Adam and Eve sinning against the Lord and the Lord forgiving them. Actually, in the context, they're clothing them. You know, they tried to cover themselves with these fig leaves and the Lord gave them, you know, these, these garments of skin, animal skin. There had to be a sacrifice. There was this atonement that was made, if you will, to cover their sins. And so um, forgiveness is is something that we see throughout the Bible prior to the coming of, of Jesus. And God is the one who gives forgiveness. Now, how in the Old Testament did people experience this? Well, first, we would want to say anyone who ever makes it to heaven or ever got to heaven, even prior to the advent of Christ, was saved by the grace of God and ultimately through Christ. Well, how did that happen if Christ hadn't done his his uh, saving work on the cross yet? What we say is that there were these, these sort of images, these types and shadows. I, I use that phrase sometimes on this broadcast, really just referring to the, those Old Testament pictures that we see, the sacrificial system, the temple, um, the, the animal sacrifice that you saw, which were really all about atonement, um, forgiveness, making a way for people to dwell in the house of God and in the presence of God. And so through these types and shadows, the image of, of the scapegoat, if you will, on the day of atonement described in Leviticus chapter 17, the people had these vivid images, pictures of how their sins would be taken away placed on this sacrificial animal. And and so it was this, this very vivid picture. And ultimately, we know that Jesus, John the Baptist says this in John chapter 1, is the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. So that all those types and shadows pointed forward to Jesus. But prior to his coming, the people looked forward to Jesus and to his saving work through those through those images, through the temple, through the priesthood, through those sacrifices, um, and were truly forgiven. Uh, one book, Raul, that you can look at um, that I, I think unpacks this a little bit more if you want to go deeper into studying is the, the book of Hebrews. Throughout the book of Hebrews, it talks about the sort of role of the Old Testament system, the priesthood, the sacrifices, how ultimately they all pointed to Jesus, the blood of bulls and goats can never really truly take away sin. It's, it's the blood of Christ. And so anyone who's ever saved in the history of, of humanity, it's been by the grace of God and through Jesus Christ and by faith. And so there's your answer, brother. Thank you so much for, for giving us a call. Hey, friends, thanks for watching that video. I trust that it was encouraging to you. Please be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel if you're looking for more great content coming from Core Christianity. And if you haven't done so yet, would you give this video a like? It's one of the ways that we can continue to get the word out. Uh, so like this video and subscribe to our channel for more content. May the Lord bless you.